Which golf course in Poway is closed? This after voters rejected a measure to rezone the property for development. The owner put up the signs just this morning, leaving workers out of a job. 10 News reporter Matt Boone takes a look at what it means for the property and the employees. Yeah, guys, going into the vote, the owner of the country club threatened to shut this place down if Measure A did not pass. Of course, it was defeated. Now signs outside say the country club is closed after 60 years of being open. The once popular Stone Ridge Country Club, now a ghost town. The only people here today, former employees coming to pick up checks or grab equipment. Thanks for putting those balls away. Woody Blocker had been a tennis instructor there for 10 months. He says he'd known his job was in limbo for a while. People had told me all along that this guy will shut the place down if it doesn't win, and he's kept his word. He's referring to owner Michael Schlesinger, who was pushing for Measure A to pass, which would have rezoned 25 acres of the country club for 180 upscale retirement condos. For the users of the club, Blanker says, there weren't many good options. They're, they're very bummed out. They just like coming here, it's convenient, and it's such a big part of the community. The worry now is the large property will become blighted and overgrown, similar to what happened with the Escondido Country Club, also owned by Schlesinger. It was shut down in 2013, raising a stink in 2014 when Schlesinger was fined for dumping five tons of raw chicken manure on it. As for the employees at Stone Ridge, Blocker says most of his colleagues had already found other jobs. But there were some holdouts. Now me, I was going to wait and see. <laughs> I've done this a long time. In Poway, Matt Boone, 10 News. 10 News reached out to a spokesperson for the owner for comment, but we haven't heard back.